Now, your local weather authority with meteorologist Mallory Jenkins. Welcome back. We are going to be looking at an air quality alert for the day tomorrow. We are looking at a hot day tomorrow as well. More rainfall moving in to start next week. And then we're looking at those temperatures cooling off toward the end of next week. Again, here we are looking at this air quality alert. This will be in effect for all of our viewing area for the day tomorrow. Again, this is because of all that smoke that will be working its way back down from Canada again. Although we're not thinking the impact will be quite as severe as what it was a couple weeks ago, this is because most of that smoke will stay into the mid and the upper atmosphere levels. You will notice a haze as we go throughout the day tomorrow that will keep those temperatures a little bit cooler, but it is still going to be a hot one tomorrow. Current temperatures across the valley right now are still in the low 80s. We have Greencastle at 82 along with Paris. Mattoon is at 83 down further to the south. Vincennes is still sitting at 88 degrees. For what we are looking at for our almanac today, we saw a high temperature of 83 degrees. It felt hotter than that due to the humidity today though the low temperature today was 70 our average high is 87 and our low is 66 the record temperature for 1980 was 107 degrees so I'll take 83 degrees as our high over 107 any day the low record was 1967 and that was at 55 degrees precipitation we saw a little over a quarter of an inch today here at the station for our monthly total we are just about three quarters of an inch over the entire monthly average and we're only about halfway through the month of July, so we have been having a really wet July so far. As we look at the Wabash River, it is sitting at 44.8 feet and that is holding steady. Taking a look at our current temperature here in Terre Haute right now, we are sitting at 85 degrees. The winds are out of the northwest at 10 miles an hour. Our pressure is at 29.8 and holding steady. Taking a look at our Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, most of us are clear right now. There is a one little cell here that's starting to work its way off into the off to the southwest. Taking a look here at our Crossroads cycle cast for this evening. It'll be a nice one. It's still going to be a little on the muggy side as we go into the evening hours tonight. Skies are clear, mostly clear right now. Temperatures are at 84 degrees. We'll have winds at out of the northwest at 8 miles an hour. And there's a slight chance of some more scattered showers moving in this evening. But again, those will be very scattered and isolated going into the overnight hours. We will remain clear for Sunday. And by Monday, then, we are looking at our next chance of rain showers moving in. In the later morning hours, this is about 10 o'clock in the morning when we'll start to see our first chances of some scattered showers Monday. Those will remain scattered through the afternoon hours. And then the next chance will move in late in the day on Tuesday and through the morning hours on Wednesday. Clear out for the afternoon hours on Wednesday and then another chance of some scattered showers moving in for the day on Thursday. Well, here's your forecast. We're looking at temperatures tonight hitting a low of 62 degrees, partly cloudy skies. We will see that wind out of the northwest at 5 miles an hour. For the day tomorrow, we will have a high of 90 degrees, sunny skies. And again, we will have that air quality alert in effect for the day tomorrow. Winds out of the northwest at 10 miles an hour. Going into the work day on Monday, we are going to see those scattered showers moving in in the morning with 84 degrees for your daytime high. Showers will go through Thursday. Temperature cooling off toward the end of the week. We'll have Jack. We'll be back with your sports right after the break.